guys. Um, <clears throat> it's a very important topic at hand here that I want to uh, cover. Very impromptu on my part. Right now, as you can see, I'm going for kind of a crackhead kind of look. I'm going for a generally disheveled kind of uh, vibe here. It's uh, pretty late, it's pr or pretty early in the morning, and here I am. Um, just live, just sitting here fuming angry. I'm steaming. Blowing out of my ear, I'm pissed right now because I, I keep, I keep seeing um, online all this online discourse crap, all this talk online about people um, like trying to. Uh, <laughs> this is really stupid. I can't believe I'm like, i like actually like stopped everything I was doing just now to be like I have, I have to let everyone know what's going on here. I have to set the record straight right now. I gotta come in here and let everybody know what the deal is. But, uh, <laughs> um, I keep seeing people, like, uh, talking about, like, how, how other, like, char how characters from anime and manga, power scaling wise, stack up to, um, the, the, the cast of Dragon Ball Z, like, the Z fighters, you know, the, the characters from, uh, Dragon Ball and, and Dragon Ball Super and all that. And the reason why I, I have a big smirk on my face is because to me it's just an abs absurd conversation, really. Because for for one, t in all in uh in the name of all uh I don't know honesty uh to keep to keep things 100 completely 100 10 out of 10, uh, the power scaling generally is fucked. Like it's 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 awful. It's it's all over the place. It's just like. You know, you have these guys where you, you think they're just stealing, and then, like, the very next guy, it's just always like, oh, he tanks him. Uh, so, like, you know, uh, you see, like, a planetary level guys like Frieza and shit, and then you see, like, Cell, and he's, like, you know, <laughs> like, like, the androids show up and they're tanking. They're just straight negging, like, Super Saiyans, like, straight up, and then, like, Cell shows up and he's negging them. And then, like, Vegeta shows up, and he goes to, like, uh, Super Saiyan one and a half, and then he negs Cell. And then Cell goes perfect form, and then he completely tanks Vegeta. Uh, that's just how it goes. It just goes like that, bing, 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 every time. And there's no nuance to it. It's just, like, this guy gets so much on this guy that this guy can no longer do a damn thing to him. It's always like that. The only fight that I can think of that really wasn't like that is, like, the earlier, like, Frieza Saga, Saiyan Saga shit, but anyway, Power Scaling and Dragon Ball Z is, like, fucked, and it's ridiculous, and I don't see why people even, like, try to, like, why people even bother trying to be like, okay, so how does my guy stack up against Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta, like, it's, it, I can't, I don't, I can't wrap my head around it, so I just wanted to come in here and, 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 uh, and just say that, like, like, nobody, as far as I'm aware, nobody, no other cast of characters in anime and manga, as far as I'm aware, can can hang with the Dragon Ball Z characters in terms of power. I have, I have never seen a single character that that is is in any way uh, comparable to even what characters like like Krillin can do at this point. Like, cause like I mean, and especially with like Super and shit. You see Krillin, like, fucking around, like, with, like, Super Saiyan Blue Goku. And that's, like, that means that, like, <laughs> that means, like, base Krillin is probably, in Dragon Ball Super, he's strong enough, he could, like, he could just absolutely demolish Perfect Cell easy. It wouldn't even be a problem. Like, it's, <laughs> which is, which is ridiculous, doesn't it? Like, uh, like, so it's, like, it's, it's absolutely absurd to me when I just hear people being, like, Oh, Uchiha Madara, he could probably be like, he could probably take on Goku, right? Like, <laughs> it, no, no, like, I can't think of a, a single character from any other series that could, that could tango with, like, Goku and Vegeta, especially, like, those two guys. Like, it just doesn't, it just doesn't, uh, it doesn't translate, because, you know, these characters are planetary level, in like the Saiyan Saga, like at like the beginning of Dragon Ball Z, these characters are like planetary level. In Dragon Ball, you know, fucking Master Roshi's blowing up the moon, 
and that's like an end game feat in Naruto, right? Like, <laughs> end game feat in basically any other series, as it should be, if you ask me. But like, it, it, Dragon Ball Z, it, it plays, it, it's built different. It, it plays by its own rules. That's how it works. It doesn't matter. So it's just really funny when I see, you know, uh, people trying to. Like even even say that like these characters can like put up a fight because I don't ah. and like I love One Piece but Super Saiyan Goku is one one v fouring he's four v oneing the Yonko and he's probably winning if I'm being honest with you like I don't give a shit how strong Shanks is as hack he is Goku can blow up the entire planet like easily like he does, without breaking a sweat he could destroy an entire planet like. Like, at, in the Cell Saga, Goku's charging up a Kamehameha before he does the warp Kamehameha. And they're all, like, shitting their pants, like, dude, if you launch out of the planet, you're gonna, it's gonna be blown to smithereens. And, like, that was, it was a hardcore Kamehameha, yes, yes, but, like, we've seen shit that's so much crazier than that at this point. Like, if he could do that in Super Saiyan 1, mastered Super Saiyan 1 in the Cell Saga, First of all, what does that mean Super Saiyan 2 Goku and Super Saiyan 3 Goku can do? And then it just keeps going from there. Like, I don't need to get into it. Everyone already knows that this shit's fucked. So, like, I don't understand why people are trying to tell me, or why people are trying to say, or even trying to, like, argue that, like, Naruto might be able to beat Goku, or, like, Naruto might be able to do, do a number on Goku. Or even, like, even, like, even hearing people try and say, like, like compare characters to Krillin because it's like Krillin it, I mean if you're scaling it and it, again the scale's broken but if you're scaling it Krillin's planetary level like Krillin can blow up a planet like I, none of the Yonko could do that uh, I don't think anyone in Naruto can do that if there's anyone I haven't seen Boruto but if there's someone in Boruto who can straight up the planet, then hey, Bob's your uncle, or you know, whatever. G give me a call, I don't care. Forget about it. Relic sentence, forget about what I said there. Um, I don't like obviously, no one in One Piece, no one in Bleach, like it's just like no one. I haven't seen anyone in any series ever even come close to the type of shit that you see in Dragon Ball Z. And that's and that's like what the best part about Dragon Ball Z is, is that these guys who could like are uh, like <laughs> like base level, they're moving like at the speed of light. Like Goku's like outrunning Kizaru and shit like that. Like it's actually it, 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 it there's a reason why the only character that can actually hang with Goku is like fucking Superman. Like the most broken guy ever is the only guy who can possibly do anything to Goku. And that's why there's the debate about it in the first place. So that's why, that's really it. I just want to, I don't know, this is kind of useless. Like, <laughs> I just want to come on here and say, and set the record straight. Let everybody know. Stop talking about this stupid shit. Stop it. Now. No one can hang with the Dragon Ball Z character. No one can hang with Tien. No one can hang with Krillin. No one can hang with fucking Piccolo or, or Yamcha. None of these, no one can hang with any of these guys. These guys are putting every fucking Yonko commander, every, you know, shoot stopping, they're putting them all to shame. It's over. Unless we're talking like some character who's got some broken ass shit like Yuhabak. I mean, here, I haven't read everything. I haven't read every single series, so if, if you know, if I'm lacking, Someone comes in here with some facts about some characters and some shit that I'm not afraid of, that I'm not worried about. I bet someone's gonna try and like tell me that. Oh well, think about it. Like Atachi, they probably. <laughs> well, I don't know. Uh, Atachi's like pretty fucking strong. If you like, Atachi could probably like do a number of like Majin Buu did probably like probably win. That's all I'm saying. All I'm saying is 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 stop talking about this crap. Stop bringing it up. Just talk it. Just keep it separate. They're two different things. Uh, don't talk about the Dragon Ball Z. I also just want to say, Naruto 
Naruto Uzumaki versus Monkey D. Luffy. Naruto wipes the floor. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to portray my, my friends, my One Piece friends. I'm sorry, but it's just not going to work out for Luffy. That's it. That's all I got to say, guys. So just, you know, stop talking about it or I'm going to be pissed.